Katie, yeah. what the hell is a fleet? <laughs> a fleet. It's essentially if you use Instagram, it's a story. Oh <laughs> but, boy! Uh, I know it's it's a lot of this. It's it's a lot of social media platforms, especially the big ones, are trying to take the best features of other social media platforms and then working it into their platform. Which, if it works for somebody else, then you want to keep people within your own particular app. So you're going to add those things that other people like. And other, you know, people like Instagram stories, you know, quick little things uh, that they can watch or pictures or text or whatever. And, um, but yeah, that's, that's, that's a fleet, which is an interesting name. I'm not sure where that name came from. <laughs> it's fleeting. Honest, it's, it's fleeting because it's 24 oh. hours. It's, it's, it's a ephemeral thing, which is what we <laughs> love because of Snapchat and TikTok and everything. I guess TikTok's not really that ephemeral, but um right i mean that, that, that's yeah, what that's I all i took it, it for <laughs> so You're probably right that's perfect um but yes so now you can do a fleet which is essentially in the nice thing about fleets is you tag people in it mm -hmm. and you know if you have people in there and the people get the notification we realize there's no refleet <laughs> no no we're trying to figure out what because we had a conversation like what happens when i tag you in this because I, I know you know the other things you get a tag and you can reshare and things like that but there's nothing really to do with it mm -mm. no refleets <laughs> I, I think the only real function is if you're on with if you're on one like i think you can message the person based on it or something mm -hmm. wait wait, wait what, where is that function like where where I, what do i even like a fleet like i don't know what <laughs> happens with it like all i have is mute and report actually but um yeah, I, I yeah, don't know. Just, there's, there's, not much, there's not much to do besides watch a fleet. Um, one of the issues with fleets is you can tag people that may have blocked you. I don't know if they've mm. corrected that issue, but that out of the gate, that was one of the issues that people were pointing out that I could block you, but then you still tag me in your fleets and I'll see it. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> uh, it's it, should I be, con you know, hey, I'm on Instagram, I'm on Snapchat, you know, say, should I bother with fleets? I think it depends on where your audience is. Like mm -hmm. if, if, you know, looking at this from a business, if most of your audience is on Twitter, yes, you should definitely continue. You should do fleets because, because you, your audience will see it. Yeah, because you're, you, it shows up right at the top. So, mm -hmm. so if you, if you follow us on awesome cast, you may notice we've been having a lot of clips, but which also means that, on the top of Twitter, because I don't think you can turn this off anywhere on your app. Mm -hmm. This is on the phone. I, I don't even think I saw it much on the on the iPad version of it or the desktop. This is mostly just on the iPhone. I'm sure it'll roll out in some fashion if they keep up with it. But but you know, hey, WWE keeps posting stuff, so they're going to be on the top. And now they're always, um, you know, that awareness factor, right? All your all your followers like will will continue to get more and more stuff as you keep using it, right? Yeah. So. so then, the, yeah. So if you're like if you're on there, if most of your friends are on there, you know, you keep using Fleet definitely. Um, but as far as I, I don't use Fleet because I just don't have as many. I, I don't know. I, maybe I, I should try it more and see if more of my friends will end up watching it because uh, I know where most of my friends are getting the information that I about me. Yeah. And a, lo a lot of times I will post things in Instagram stories because. Instagram does not do a very good job of presenting your your po posts to a very wide audience or chronologically, but that's a different story altogether. So I know a lot of times I'll post things in my Instagram or Facebook stories because more people will see that than will see my actual posts. Yep. Yep. So the same thing goes with Twitter. I bet. I think now that I think that now that I've worked my way back, um, tweets only live with they figure like 20, 25 minutes and then it's gone. If you haven't seen it, if someone hasn't seen it at that point, they're most likely not going to see it. Uh, well, yes, but doesn't it, um, if there's reactions to it, like I I, mm -hmm. I see a lot of tweets from like the day before if there's been a lot of mm -hmm. like likes and comments on it. So, I mean, it, that really becomes like a Facebook thing. Like they took away the idea that Twitter is like a thing that just kind of goes away. Right. Mm -hmm. um, tweets were initially kind of fleeting because it was like, if you don't see it in your feed. So we, we kept pushing the feed, pushing the feed. Um, but now it's 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 like Facebook where it's this algorithm thing, right? Mm -hmm. The the other thing is is um, you can send tweets to a fleet. <laughs> <laughs> so if you get the share button, you'll see 
you know, there is a there is a share of fleet, and it'll, it'll represent that there. And it's another way, I, I, you know, probably like you're kind of sending posts to, to stories and things, Katie, right? Where now, mm-hmm. now you that is at the top of the page, and you're like, oh hey, you know, uh, Awesome Cast sort of posted something, and then it's just like a tweet, and you, you can follow through from there. It's just kind of another, it's just another way to, to 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 get it in front of people, I guess. And again, I can't really mm-hmm. speak to how many people are using. It. I haven't seen a lot of response to it yet myself, um, but th- that may change over time. So mm-hmm. I don't know. It was something to play around with, see what happens for you. Or just like two seconds, throw it up there and could be in front of my more eyeballs. Anything else big with Twitter that's been happening over the last, you know, we talked a little bit about like their um, settings for, for muting and, and kind of calling your your uh, uh, feed and everything. 